All right, here we go. This is a uh, damn it. This is a 147 grain, uh, just full metal jacket, 308. You can see there's a pretty heavy crimp on there. There we go. There's the focus. I just loaded this up. There's a really heavy, not super heavy to damage the bullet, but there's a pretty decent crimp on that. I have a, I put a spent primer in there, just, I don't know why, but I pulled the anvil out. There's no powder in here. I know, someone's going to call me stupid, but yeah, it's a empty cup of brass, basically. And here we have a Not sure why we're having fucking why we can't focus. Ew. This is an 18 inch Lothar Walther 556 wild barrel or 223 wild barrel, whatever it's called. Again, let's fill it. Locked in there. I don't know if I just show that or not, but same bullet. Locked in. And our hmm. Not sure that that did not. I don't know if that's. Uh, focused or not but if you can see that did not chamber attempt to pull the trigger now I don't know if anyone just heard that but the hammer definitely went now just for comparison put the bolt back that's it closed all the way. It was like that. The 300 blackout. Now, it's a note here. There was some bullet setback. I didn't measure it, but this is pretty easy to tell, but the bullet did set back because before the cantilever was visible. Now it's not. Now, of course, thinking back, I probably should have marked the primer to see if we actually got a good indent on that. I'm going to try to pull this bullet and do this all over again. Put some uh, white out or something in that, see if it actually hits it. In video sponsored by TGN. To learn more, visit TGN.tv.